Okay, I am about to geek out. I'm freaking out here. On March 12th, Game of Thrones composer Ramin Javadi will turn Tampa Bay into Westeros. Yes, HBO's Emmy-winning phenomenon is coming to Amelie Arena in concert form. We're joined by the man himself. Ramin, tell us about this amazing event. Well, I'm very excited that uh, I'm finally able to uh, take this on tour. It, it took about three years, actually, to get this going. Um, it, you know, it started with just a, a little idea in the studio, having one concert, uh, and it just kind of escalated into what it is now, which is this uh, epic, immersive concert experience uh, across the U.S. So I'm very excited about uh, being there myself, actually, with it. So when you say immersive, are there going to be like white walkers chasing people through the aisles and stuff like that? What do, what do we get? <laughs> <laughs> um, something like that, possibly. Really? I mean, That's awesome. The idea. <laughs> well, the idea is that the, the the stage itself already screams Westeros. It's designed and inspired by the show. Uh, the uh, it has things that we call analog and digital content, where the the screens with digital screens that they, they move. They they uh, have diff different content. For example, they can move around the orchestra and, and put a snowstorm on it, so it looks like the orchestra is literally in a snowstorm north of the wall. So it's uh, it's a, a very a visually exciting uh, show, um, and uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm very excited about being able to to put something like this together. Let me ask. I, I, I could talk to you for really like three hours, but is it going to be chronological with the series? How the uh, sort of. I mean, it was very hard to. Uh, yeah, it, it, it was very difficult to put together because obviously we have six seasons of material. And to summarize that into one short concert, I mean, I could have easily had a six-hour concert of, for this, but um, uh, I really summarized it into a quick thing. We, we pretty much start at the beginning, but then with montages, we we jump around a bit. But it, uh, the idea is really that we start with season one, and by the end of the concert, uh, you know, we have reached season six, and then hopefully everybody's excited about season seven. You as an artist, the the the, the complexity and and the, the different. Uh, places you have to go in this. I mean, it must be quite a challenge because you have uh, King's Landing is one set of music. Then you go to Marine, where you have Middle Eastern touches. Tell, tell us about the creative approach to doing this. Yeah, I think that's something that was so um, appealing for me f to do this concert because I'm using different instrumentation. Uh, it's not only orchestral music. Uh, there's very eclectic instruments I'm using. There's a, a, an Armenian duduk, for example. There's a hammered dulcimer. And I think it'll just be exciting for the audience to see uh, some of these instruments live and have uh, musicians perform these instruments. The, uh, the theme song is so iconic now, considered one of the greatest TV theme songs of all time. Can you take us into how you developed that, the genesis of the Game of Thrones theme? Uh, sure, yeah. I mean, it's um, David and Dan, the, the showrunners of the show, they took me to the, the effects house and actually showed me where the visuals were created. Um, and they just kind of talked me through the show and then just we discussed just that the the main theme needs to really summarize the the, the entire show, um, and based on that, it was the, seeing the visuals, their creative input uh, that that's what made me and got me inspired to write this theme. Do you know now? Have you seen season seven? You know all the secrets. Come on, give us some secrets. Who gets the throne? Who gets the Iron Throne? <laughs> to, be <complete> me? <laughs> to be completely honest, I have not seen anything yet, actually. They, uh, they're still shooting. Really? And um, I'm, I'm excited, just like anybody else, to see what's coming next. But Obviously, I will, probably, uh, I will see it before everybody, but at this point, I haven't seen anything. Well, that's funny, because they were supposed to start in the summer. That, that kind of puts pressure on you to put all the music together, right? Uh, it's actually quite normal to have this kind of schedule. I, I don't really come into... Um, uh, into play until the very, very end when they go into post-production. So it's, uh, I mean, uh, usually I'm even still working on episodes when the show is already on air. So it's, it's always a very tight schedule that it, uh, I'm wow. used to at this point. Hey, Ramin, this has been such a pleasure. Game of Thrones, the concert, March 12th in Tampa. Thank you so much and good luck on tour. Oh, thanks so much. I'm very excited to be coming out.